Although I might want to use it more often because there aren't very many boss battles in the game. I think there's actually only a few. Okay, just lure them all down here and just start picking them off. Alright. That's all of them. Not too troublesome. Now where do I go? Up here, huh? I hear the little guys. What up, Fuzzball? How's it going? Up, oh, you died. These must be the babies. Ow. Oh yeah, huh? I can swim. One left. We got some health back. Ah, oh, crap. Why did the bear? Oh, never mind. I think that that was explained and I just wasn't paying attention. Ow, that's crap. Okay, that's all of them. Okay. Ah, and the skull gems just come to me. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, and they give you a shortcut to come straight back, which is nice. No work whatsoever. They're usually pretty good that if you have to go like all the way around or do something that takes a long time, they're usually good about giving you a, a shortcut to get you uh, way back. All right. I don't need... I don't need a gun right now. Although there will be times later where guns on vehicles come into play as very useful. Very, very useful. But that's that's a pretty long way into the game. We will have come a long way before that comes into play. Yeah, I don't really know where I should be getting to within an hour. Like, I just don't remember the missions that well. Like, the Pacific Order. I remember a good deal of them, but I'm sure there's gonna be a few that's like, Oh yeah! Forgot about that. Like, I forgot about the turret one. I knew I knew I had to go in the sewers for something, but... I forgot why, obviously. It's because I have to, uh... Clear out some turrets. Like, I don't know what the next mission is. I honestly couldn't tell you. I'm... He's probably gonna send me to the port right now to go get my gun upgrade. And then, after that, I have no idea what's going to happen. What is that horrible smell? <laughs> oh, great! We do your dirty work in the sewers and come back smelling worse than a wet hip hog in a warm barn! This could have a serious impact on the lady factor. No. <clears throat> I think it was my lunch, actually. Nice work in the sewers, eh? I guess you're looking for that weapon upgrade. Mm. Well, there's a blast of mod stashed in some crates at the port. Find it, and it's yours. <laughs> Alright. So, uh, don't steal the Hellcat, or the Hellbike, or whatever it is. We're gonna go get our gun upgrade. I like this one. It's probably the most useful one out of all... It's probably the one I'll use the most out of all of them. Not your most useful. Definitely not the most useful, but this one will probably be used the most. Ah, come here, blaster mod. Well, bink!
can switch weapon modes at any time. You can combo your attacks by kicking, then firing your weapon. Kick the first target, then shoot while kicking to automatically hit the second target. Not quite. Try again. Kick, then shoot, almost at the same time. Oh, okay. I just wasn't in the right spot. That's a wastelander move. They won't know what hit them. You can find yellow ammo in crates. Would you like to test your skills on the gun course? Hell yeah, I would. There's also another trick that they don't teach you, which I'm going to show you right now. Ready? Go. If you do this, you're going to hit pretty much everything. And I mean everything. Well, almost everything at least. The downside is it uses a fuck ton of ammo. And I mean a fuck ton. I'm also gonna miss and waste a fuck ton of ammo, but... Anything else? I'm out of ammo. Shit. Congratulations. You achieved the bronze record. Oh well. Oh, yeah. If you uh complete that, you'll get uh get some orbs if you can beat all the course records. However, I don't really uh Nothing so far. Let me see. Yeah, anyways, I don't really uh, want to go for those because once you get the upgrades, it's a lot easier to go through the gun range and get them all. Especially the ammo upgrades. They really help. I have a proposition for you, Jack. Racing is the biggest sport in the city. Errol is the undisputed grand champion. He's crazy and dangerous on the track. <laughs> My kind of guy. Only a fool would dare race against him, eh? And that's where you two come in. A client of mine is looking for a fast driver for her racing team. Here's a security pass to get you into the stadium section. Uh, and your contract with just a few trifles for me. <laughs> I've uh, already signed your name to save time. Hmm? We the racers hereby agree to give crew all proceeds from race earnings, endorsement fees, broadcast royalties, syndication residuals, vehicle sponsorships, small appearance fees, collectible card assets, fast food tie-ins, use of likeness rights, talk show deals, clothing lines, all print rights including book, novella, comic, pamphlet, ticket tape, neon sign, and bathroom graffiti designs. <sighs> Toy rights, shoe lines, mood rings, game rights. Game rights? Vitamin endorsements, city kickback, movie deals, and of course, all death and dismemberment accident insurance claims. <laughs> we can work out the tiny details later. If you can get from here to the race garage near the stadium in less than three minutes, my client said she would consider letting you drive for her team. Make me proud. Mm. I'm gonna be honest, didn't realize we got to this mission this early. Can I get on here? I know where I have to go. There's only one way to go. Three minutes? I could probably do it in two minutes and 30 seconds. And stop for coffee on the way. I know that's not a joke.
I might get the Crimson Guard after me, though. We'll see how it goes. I have to be a little bit reckless. But three minutes, it's a lot of time. Shit, I went the wrong way. But then again, it's very generous time, which I will probably need. Because I went down the wrong corner. Even if I barely make it, it we're still good. Maybe I'm not as confident as I was about four seconds ago. Okay, this might impede on my uh, racing performance. Especially with those turrets. Those turrets are god awful mean. Shoot. God, just. Those turrets just blasted some chick. I'm gonna try an old trick of mine. Uh, I don't know if I'm, if I played this long enough yet to, uh, do it, but we'll see. Okay, got it. That can be a little difficult to pull off depending on who you are and how fast you're going in. Here's the stadium section. Yeah, I got a whole, I got a whole minute. I could stop for some coffee, fuck with the Crimson Guards. Maybe get a police detail on me or something. I don't know. I meant to do that. Alright. Shiz. Okay. So maybe I didn't get there on... With 30 seconds to spare. But I came pretty damn close. I made it to the stadium with 30 seconds to spare. All right, good enough. Uh, hello? Crew said someone was looking for a race driver? I'm busy right now. You must be Crew's new errand boy. Look, I don't mean to be rude. You did get here fast, but I'm not interested in any new drivers right now. And I've got work to do. Is there anything we can do? No, I'm uh, working on a secret uh, uh, vehicle project. Okay, sorry. Listen, if you think you've got the guts to race in this town, Try taking my prototype jet board out on the stadium court. Beat the stadium challenge and maybe I'll consider you for my team. <laughs> Good old dads, dude. I love them. And jet board. I love that little scene where both, they're both just like, jet board. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Jet board. Wow, that, that really destroys my voice. Fuck. Not jet board. What the hell? What? What is going... What did I do? Oh my god. Do, 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 do. Alright guys, well, I'll see you later. I just gotta go. Okay, this will probably fix itself real quick. Yeah, this is an interesting turn of events. Hmm. Oh, it's still glow. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Oh. How do I... 